Day two of big party at a gang funeral. Oh my goodness. So I told you that this funeral is not just a funeral, it's a celebration of life. And at the moment, <laughs> we have the pretty Chelsea here. I don't know if she's taking, maybe she can tell you guys if she's available because she's so pretty. I'll leave her link here below. You can go if she's available. <laughs> and our pretty makeup artist. She's also available for booking. Okay. For booking. She's taken, so she can't be available for that. All right, so these are my girls. <laughs> the ashes of the big party <laughs> funeral. <laughs> I had for us the makeup artist. You guys, you can just imagine, okay? So when everything is done, I'll give you the final result. The final look of everybody. She's too pretty for this camera. I'm imagining my face. I'm going to It's okay. It's okay. I'm not done yet. Space needles. Space needles. Masma. Masma. Make sure some my space name. Hi guys. Good morning. So. Like I was saying, today is day two of the big party gun funeral. Yeah, so this is the area that I am. As you can see, this place looks very beautiful. This is Kwabenya. Uh, is it SK Junction? Yeah, something of that sort. When I was in the process of the makeup, I showed it to you. This is the final result. I'm not a fan of all this, you know. I was doing this, but I stopped because I used the products which i felt like has damaged my skin so i stopped doing all these kind of things let me just show you this beautiful house look at how it looks oh my god this is a residential area so you find this kind of beautiful houses all around here oh look at that it's so beautiful and every house here their gates are automatic as they are coming to just press the remote and the thing opens up voila so when the lady was in my makeup she'll be like look up and i'm like why look up smile laugh and i'm like there's nothing to laugh about it's like doing makeup is so funny you'll be asked to do a lot of funny stuff so this is a hairdresser salon right there um i'm looking for the seamstress okay so they just ask us to send our measurements so that our uniforms for the ushering will be sold for us. But as they brought it yesterday, it was not fitting. Not everything was fitting. So this is a church. Royal Grace Sanctuary. And this is a salon as well. And uh, like I was saying, the dress that they, they sold for us they were not that fitting so we just brought it here for great to be all treated so that's why i'm here to check morning so i don't know why the lady was doing the sewing I was so pissed off she was smiling with the other ladies as i got there. i don't know if it's because of the camera but anyways like i was talking about my makeup you guys what do you think I feel like the brow is too big and too dark. What do you think? I have mixed feelings. I feel like it's it's pretty, but it soon looks like the brow is too dark. And the lashes, I feel so much uncomfortable because it's not something I'm used to. So it's so rare on my face. That's why I'm feeling the discomfort. So I think with that one, I'll get used to with time. But I'm just saying, the bra what do you guys think drop a comment and let me know so let me just get going i'll get dressed and picture time let you guys see the final look the final look my outfits of the day and the makeup and everything i'll do you Do you think? <laughs> 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 I 
big party funeral. No, no, wait. No, no, no. My sweet baby, I told you she's available. She's not taken. Are you taking? No. Uh -uh. I'm not taking. I'm very single. She's very single. Ready to mingle. Okay. Ready to mingle. So guys, you can bring in uh -huh, your applications. Uh -huh. Okay. <laughs> One of the advantages of joining this group for me is that we get to travel within Ghana to places that under normal circumstances I may not have traveled to. It gives me the opportunity to discover places and connect with new people. Although I still have that kind of social anxiety, I still love to discover and connect with people. So yeah, I'm happy joining this group. The rubber I'm tearing will be used to tie the food packages into multiples of 10 so that they are easier to count because we are expecting about a thousand plus plates of food. And as you can see, we are counting them in 10s. You remember the times table, right, in primary school? Exactly. <laughs> production company what's the name of the company transformation yes yes you work for that but transformation is not a production company transformation studios oh okay, okay. all right that's my thank you your name jonathan i'm little so today mr jonathan was the one to give my videos you guys <laughs> <laughs> This is the popular Ghanaian jollof served with chicken and beef. And this one is very sumptuous. Where are my Nigerians in the house? I just wish you had tasted this jollof. You would have shut your mouth forever about Nigeria having the best jollof. <laughs> okay. All right, you know. if I try. Hi guys. So here is the kitchen for a big party cooking. Today is the day of burial and tomorrow is for the after party. In most Ghan funeral settings, although there is mourning, the parting and enjoyment supersedes the mourning. There is always enough to drink and eat, especially if the person is old enough. Hence the cooking by our dear hardworking mama. <laughs> They are the flesh from the boat. Hi. Hello. I'm just taking a video. You can take a video about office. What? What meat is that? Cow. Cow meat. Okay. And this one to the same. Yes. Wow. Yes, where they are cleaning the pots used for the big party cooking. Hard working parties. The primary reason for being here is not to film at all. <laughs> Our madam is packaging the. 
fine. Just like it's supposed to be. Then what can that be with you? Isn't she beautiful? Yeah. Yes. Okay. This is the funeral grounds and as you can see almost everyone is wearing white because the deceased is old enough otherwise they would have worn red or black or something with both colors. At the moment they are filing past the corpse after which they will go bury it and come back for lunch. Serve me, serve me. I thought you were vegetarian. Do they have vegetarian food? Guys, I've been so hungry, right? Since morning. It's about what's the time? 12, 12 something. Like my stomach was crying. I became like a deaf and dumb person. I was not talking again. This is boy. I'm taking this is Ghana Jollof. If you have eaten Ghana Jollof before, can you drop a comment and let me know? I don't know what this is, but I'm just going to eat it like that. I've been starving for so long, so let me just do justice to this and get back to you guys. Oh, fine, I'm me. Thank you. I finished it. Better malt. Better malt. This is Ghana Jollof. I never tasted Ghana Jollof. So fast forward, we are done eating and had already served the attendees of the funeral, the food packages and drinks. And the deceased has also already been buried, so it's time for music and dance. So you guys, come along and let's go do some African dance. <laughs> about RC events, what you do. Yes, RC like, events, so tell us about RC. Okay, so basically we cook. It's, the way slow down. What I'm saying is basically we cook good food. So if you need good food, you can call on us. We also do decorations for your weddings, parties. Yeah, watch it. is our specialty. So if you need good food or you want to lick your fingers, just call on us. Yeah. All right. Thank you so much. Most welcome. The link is in the bio, right? Description below. <laughs>